What's up you guys, my name is Natty and welcome to the Back to Hogwarts quiz. Now this is a quiz on Pottermore that I didn't know about until um, a YouTuber called Rob's Gaming Corner uh, told me about it. Uh, check his channel out, it's cool. Uh, so I didn't know this existed until he told me and I was like, it's a Pottermore quiz, it's a Potter quiz, I have to take it, you know I'm like about Harry Potter. So this is the Pottermore Back to Hogwarts quiz, it's the easy one. And it's how well do you know the wizarding world? When it comes to all things Hogwarts, are you the wise old owl? Or is your knowledge as woolly as one of Mrs. Weasley lovely jumpers? Okay, so let's go straight into this. So, what's our first question? Which creature is depicted in the emblem for the Gryffindor house? That is, a lion. I'm a proud Gryffindor. Among the wizarding community, the term muggle refers to what kind of person? A non-magical person from a non-magical family. It is that one. Non-magical person from a magical family, magical person who's really bad at magic. No, it's a non-magical person from a non-magical family. True or false, Professor Dumbledore's spectacles are rectangular. They're not. They are half-moon crescents, I believe. Yep, there we go. Which Hogwarts student says, I don't go looking for trouble? Trouble usually finds me. Harry Potter, Draco Malfoy, Ron Weasley, Fred Weasley. Ron, why does it look like you're on a trampoline? I don't know what you're doing there. Fred looks like he's just pe peeking behind the curtain. Draco just looks like Draco. And Harry Potter's just catwalk modelling. Well, it's Jenny Harry Potter who says that. Yes. Set to all that apply, members of Ravenclaw House are known for possessing which two of the following traits? Intelligence, cunning, wit, or loyalty. I know it's intelligence because they're kind of like the brainy bunch. Cunning? No, that's more of a... Uh, Slytherin type thing. Wit, maybe loyalty. Loyalty is more Gryffindor. I'm gonna go for wit. Yes, okay, that's correct. Nice. Okay, cool. What is the spell for the ch summon charm? I can't even pronounce that word. Accio. Uh, I'm gonna think it's Accio. Yep. I don't remember what the other ones were actually, to be honest. What colour is a Hogwarts Express? Oh, it's like a red, isn't it? Scarlet, coal, indigo, or emerald. I'm going to say it's a scarlet. Nice! I wouldn't have, you know, I would have just said red. Red would have done. How are parcels and letters sent in the wizard world? Via owls. Oh, wizard postman. I would have loved to have seen a wizard postman. That would have been pretty awesome. Which Hogwarts student says, just because you've got the emotional range of a teaspoon doesn't mean we all have. Hermione Granger. Ah, good sentence. I love that. Love that phrase. Okay. What do Harry and Ron crash into the Weeping Willow? That's when they fly Arthur Weasley's Ford Angler to the Hogwarts house, the Weeping Willow. One old Weasley, how dare you steal that car? Your father's facing an inquiry at work and it's all your fault. And if you put another step out of line, we're taking you out of Hogwarts. Something like that. And by the way, Ginny, congratulations for being sorted into that. To Hogwarts. I can't remember the full quote. It's something like that. So, 10 out of 10. Back to, yes. Nice. Okay, that is pretty cool. Oh, that is so cool. That's only easy though. So that's of course going to be the, the easiest question. So, next time we're going to do the medium quiz. So, hopefully that it's just going to go like this. This was pretty cool. Uh, I will put a link down below where you can take this quiz yourself. Um, yeah, it's pretty cool just to redo all this knowledge because it's been a long time since I read the books and probably seen the films. So, well, I say long time, it's probably been a few few months since I last seen the films. But still, that's a long time in Harry Potter world. So, guys, if you like this video, make sure you give the like button a little click so I know. And be sure to subscribe for more videos in the future. And I'll see you in the next one. Uh, bye!